Yeah, I had a leg. Got a jacuzzi room. <laughs> no dick. <laughs> uh, y'all, I really had a leg on this room though. Had a motherfucking leg. Had a leg, bitch. Had a leg. Ooh. All right, hey y'all. Welcome back to my channel. I am here in Des Moines, Iowa. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing here in Iowa, but I'm here. <laughs> Period. I'm going to go try out at a club called Minx. And then another club called... I think he said Lumbiard or Lumbiard. One of them. But yeah, I'm going to go try out at one of them clubs tonight. Um, I'm here till Friday. It's Tuesday. I'm here till Friday. So y'all, I'm on a motherfucking money trip. Straight business. But I need to go to a nail shop. But I also need to take a nap because I'm tired, y'all. Me and my friend, we went to a bar last night and we got drunk as fuck. When I say drunk as fuck, we got drunk as fuck. But yeah, so tonight I'm going to go to, not even tonight, like maybe 5 p.m. I'm going to go try out at the two clubs, see which one I get hired at. And I'm going to work there until Friday. So y'all, if you want to watch me, you know, work. If y'all want to see it, you know, like the whole process type shit, continue watching. I'm finna go smoke a blunt and then take a nap because y'all bitch is tired. I'm fucking tired. Like, I think I got jet lag from the flight. So yeah, I'll be back. Yo, I, got to, I tried to take a nap. Didn't happen. I think I need to smoke again. Maybe I'll take a nap. But like, it's two o'clock here and like my body is still like on Arizona time. So like, I'm still like, it's 12 o'clock there or 11 o'clock there, 12 o'clock there. I think it's 12. <laughs> I think we just two hours ahead here, but yeah, like my body is still on Arizona time. Like I still want to go to sleep. I need to get up though. Cause I need, I need to go to a nail shop. Cause I'm all sad. Yeah, I'm, I need to go to the nail shop for sure. Because my toes is a little crusty, dusty, busty. And my nails is definitely crusty, dusty, busty. But I just ordered some pizza. Yeah. I just ordered me some pizza, y'all. And, yeah. I ordered some pizza. What the fuck is my sausages at, though? Them ain't never my sausage. Pizza Hut ain't never just homie. Okay, Pizza Hut. Y'all too. Count y'all fucking days. Count y'all motherfucking days. Y'all look crusty as fuck. Like, I'm gonna take these braids down now. Because I'm not feeling them. I'm not feeling them. I'm not feeling them. I'm mad as fuck I got this room. Well, I'm not mad that I got this room, but I got a jacuzzi room. And I'm out here solo as fuck. I got a jacuzzi room. I mean, I guess I can get in there and relax my body, you know, after I keep them dancing. So, I mean, it's I'm about to eat. Then I'm gonna smoke again. Then I'm gonna get dressed. And be out. Y'all. <laughs> no, let me stop. But um, right now, 
I'm waiting on my friend. We finna run to the mall. Y'all feel like a dirty ass bitch. I forgot to pack toothpaste. Like, how? I got my toothbrush, but no toothpaste. Don't wanna talk about it. Don't wanna talk about it. Don't wanna talk about it. But yeah. Y'all know the two piece outfit from Fashion Nova. Y'all know. I just got that even pizza. I'm full. But I'm looking a little too much. <laughs> No, nah, but I'm waiting on my friend. We finna go to the mall. Uh, she about to bring me some toothpaste. I need to put on my eyelashes. Because the bitch looking a little baldy. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bitch, I'm in your city now. <laughs> you vlogging? Yep. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> That's my well, puppy. <laughs> That's me. Why is this Forever 21 so big, though? Huh? You said you just be buying shit? Look at that baby. Shorty with the baby. <laughs> oh, that's. Is that cover ups? Oh, two ninety nine. Oh, I wonder if they got some cute, like little one pieces, like rompers. Bald. Eyebrows on fleek though. Oh, they got some. Are these body suits? I never really shot there Forever 21 because it's like. They like another H&M to me. Who oh, them? Forever twenty? Who? Oh, I gotta be on Fashion Nova. But Fashion Nova. Yeah, Fashion Nova finna stop getting my money. They finna stop getting my money because all my clothes they've been sending me not the size that I've been asking for. So Fashion Nova Contra Days. A mall for the pink that's open. Let's go. Hello. Okay, thank you. Yes, fifty percent off. Uh oh. Oh, fifty percent off. Yes, baby. Oh, they got, oh yeah, they got a sale sale. You live in Des Moines? No, Arizona. Arizona? Mm -hmm. Oh, you come here visit? Yeah. Over there. Yeah, real hot. Really hot. Really hot. Really hot. You want shellac? Huh? You want shellac? My hand? No, you want shell color huh? and uh, shellac and peel $45, okay? Okay. Because you keep one too. Yep. Yeah. And I broke that one. Mm-hmm. 
And you want to touch up, right? Say that again. You want to touch down a little bit? Yes. He leaning hard as hell. What you smoking? Hey. What's that? A cigarette? Yeah, this is a cigarette. Oh, we better put that out. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, so we just left one of the clubs. I'm gonna dance that while I'm out here. Mm, can I see you? Get out the car. This is the club right here, Big Earl. Big Earl. Um, yeah, she told me to come back at 9 30, 10 o'clock to audition because I guess, like, the house mom, I think that's what she said, the house mom, not there yet. She don't get in until that time. So, I'm gonna go back to my room. My homegirl gonna do my hair. Period. You know the first time I did your shit? I know. <laughs> when I did that song, and it took hours. Bro, for real. <laughs> but it came out good. <laughs> but yeah, she gonna do my. So we can go back to the room, take my hair down, wash it, and shit, get ready. Damn, it's eight o'clock for real. Yeah, bitch, we got an hour here. Yeah, we got two hours. She said 9 30, 10 o'clock. Bet, bet, bet. Yeah, so I'll see y'all when we get back to the room. You didn't go over there with my hair. I think he is. He bought his ticket. If he even bought it, because when I was on the phone with him, he was like, I'm waiting for my uh, booking agent to. Huh? <laughs> you know Will has me talking that oh, shit. Oh, Will not coming. Yeah. But yeah, y'all. I went to um, I went to college with her. But yeah, let's tell let's let's do a story time on how we like met, how, like okay. how we know each other. So, did I hit you up or did you hit me up on Twitter? Um I think I think you hit me up and you asked me like, hey, are you on the Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I think I have put it in my bio. I was going to oh, yeah. Wood. yeah, you the so first I had, person yeah. I talked to from that school mm -hmm. before we even got there. So I had hit her up because, you know, when you first get to college and shit, like, you see who your roommates and shit is going to be, like, their social medias and shit, or just their name. Mm -hmm. So I'm searching bitches' names and shit. I'm like, hell no, I need to know. Oh, for real. Because I ain't never had a roommate before. And so when I see your name, I just hit you up and shit. But... Still at that time when I was hitting you up, I'm like, hell no, I still don't want no fucking roommate. Mm -hmm. So I'm still trying to get into a house and get a single bedroom. Yeah. And you were one of the first people on, on the campus too. Yeah, because I had two because I was with, what was I getting, an RA? Yeah. And then when everybody got the campus and shit, like everybody really, I feel like everybody clicked. Right away. And it was crazy, like I feel like Lindenwood was just one big family. Oh God, it was. So then. We ended up, we were supposed to be roommates and shit, but then I ended up moving into the house and shit. And she just, she was RA, so she just stayed over at the girls' dorm. The girls' dorm, y'all, the shit was so fucking nasty. Like, the bitches in there was trifling as fuck. It was always throw up on the floor. A dirty ass tampon. And then, like, the showers with the hair. That shit, it disgusts yeah. me, bro. Like, living with a bunch of girls, and it, it had to be at least, like, what? 100, 200 mm -hmm. girls in that one dorm, yeah. that one building. So then, so we went on break. It was like, what, Christmas break? And mind you, like, I wasn't, I wasn't fucking around with nobody for real. I was just by myself. And then, uh, did you hit me up saying that you was gonna move in? Or somebody, somebody told me that you was gonna move in. I'm like, hell no, nah, I don't need, hit me another fucking <laughs> I'm like, I ain't trying to be, I ain't, hell no, I'm cool by myself. Man. But then, that's the end of moving in, and like, we just got, we just clicked. Like, you got hella close. Hell yeah. Bitch, and then, yo, yes, we, and then, bitch, when you left me, too, like, yeah, you gotta tell that whole story. Uh, Can you tell that whole story? Yeah. So, y'all, what was it, my second year there? Yeah. Second year back? Mm-hmm. Y'all, so, I had a situation, my dad had passed away while I was in school. No, my my dad passed away and then my auntie passed away. I think your aunt passed first, right, right? No, my dad did. My dad had passed. Oh, yeah, 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 right. Yeah, he had passed. And then six months later, my daddy had passed. I mean, my auntie had passed. It was six months later? Yeah. I don't think it was that long. Yeah. But they died in April. And then my auntie died in 
October. I don't know why it felt like your shit was just back to back. Like, bro, that shit was like, cause it's just like I couldn't get over my daddy then. My auntie passed away. Yeah. It was just like too much. Because with your dad, like, he was missing for a break. Yeah, he was missing. You gotta tell that story on, on its own. So. Yeah. Yeah. So my dad had my, my dad had passed away, then my auntie had passed away, and it was just like, group. yeah, I was just like fed up. You know, I was like, I couldn't do it no more. I needed to be around like my mama. So I had left my friend at school. My mom and him drove all the way from Arizona to fucking by like St. Louis, y'all, to come and get me. A Z to St. Louis. Look yeah. that up. That's like that's like a whole. That's like a whole day. Yeah, a whole entire day. A whole 27 hours plus but more. Really, I didn't think he was gonna leave for real. I hope he was gonna tell my mom like their mom shit. They was already on highway. I was so sad. Like, <laughs> bitch, did, did we cry when you left? Yeah, we cried a little bit. That's that cool shit. Yeah, with my ex. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That, that's a whole other story. You got a lot of stories. You can do a like, hella story time. For real. Right? For real. Cause that nigga put me through some shit. Some shit. Mm -hmm. Nigga damn near made me go broke while I was at school. Bro. Thought I was gonna feed him you breakfast, lunch, and dinner. <laughs> Like, okay, you my boyfriend and all, but baby. Nah, she had a son, dude. No, he, I was like his mom. Like, I took care of that nigga. That's my son. Yeah, that's still your son. <laughs> what time is it? I should have set an alarm. It's 8.49. What time you got to be there? She said 9.32 o'clock. We're right down the street. Oh, we went to a bar last night, right? Uh, Girl, and it was a stripper. That, remember I was saying, like, the, it, like, a little hole in the wall? Yeah. So I was a dancer up there. Y'all, when I went up there to throw some ones on her, when I say fucky. Oh, nah. Bitch. So what's like the one-on-one -on -one rule? Is there like a one-on-one -on -one rule? Like, like if you, you, you because if you gonna smell yourself. It's common sense. You gonna smell yourself before another motherfucker smell you, you know? Yeah. So she up there just shaking ass, swinging. I'm just, I got a whiff of it. I'm like, yo, I'm like, yeah, I'll just do the rest of the ones on her. And she was like, thank you, I want to tell her so bad, bitch, get down and go, go clean yourself up. <laughs> it was a mixture of musk and fish. Nah. Bitch. She had a long night. Them two don't go together. Mm -hmm. And wasn't nobody in there for her to be sweating the way she was sweating. What do you think looking at the window for? They see you? Yeah. <laughs> I wonder what it looks like I'm doing. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> What? Bitch, I'm down here. They probably like, what the fuck going on? <laughs> and my hands is like this. <laughs> uh, I'm all into it, too. Yeah, she probably uh, like, these bitches eating each other out in there. <laughs> Negative. Because you can't even see how low, like, the flow is. Bro, but yeah, so um, the pool party that in um, Arizona, that shit went viral. Bitches on there sucking cucumbers, putting in each other pussies. <laughs> Bitch, for real. And then they told this one girl, you know, I give you 3K if you put this glass dick in your pussy. She did it. They did not get shorty a dollar. Wow. Bro. She put a glass dick in her pussy? Yes, bro. Bitches went out sad, like, for $300. When they say bitches will do something strange for a piece of chain. That's the truth. They ain't lie. Because, baby, them bitches was in there going nutty. You be, like, you be nervous when you go to the strip animal club? Um, sometimes, but like, now that I'm here, I, I don't care because nobody know here. Yeah. See, people, like, a lot of people know me in Arizona for basketball. So, like, when they see me in a club, I'd be like, surprise. Yeah. I'd be like, surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> do you, um, what about when you, like, why have you done it in Chicago? Like, motherfucker? Like, yeah, and then I got hella family out there, and then, like, my uncles and shit always be in the blues. So, it's just like, it'll be awkward when they see me have naked. We're ready to go. This is my results from my hair. Period. You ready? I wear a little black dress so they can see my figure. Yeah, Hold on, she finna show y'all. Show me your hair. It's cute. Of course. Shout out to Rose. Knocking shit over. Got the beat. Got you need that. All right. Should you take that too? Mm -hmm. Yo. For your edges. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here's your lip gloss and shit. You got the room key? Got the room You sure? Yep. Got my blunt. 
The essential slide. Mm -hmm. The room key in the blank. Mm -hmm. Lip gloss. Did you show them the pool? No, I didn't even know it was open. They in here? Nah. Alright, come on, you gotta go. This bitch late. What time is it? Jeez. It's 10 43. You should be supposed to be there at 9 30, 10 o'clock. I'm crazy. Look. At least we're not far. Look. 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 Is this the same as AZ in it? So, uh, it's desert. Dust, dirt. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I ain't hear nothing a couple times before I go audition. You smoking here or no? Yeah, you can. You sure? Yeah. You sure? You sure? You sure? Yeah. Alright, y'all. I'm on my way to the club. I will see y'all when I get there. <laughs> it's fuck y'all new club yeah i'm a little nervous i ain't even gonna flex okay, new club new club new club and she nervous she ain't talking about <laughs> wait didn't i ask you earlier did you get nervous and shit you mm -hmm. said what'd you say no bitch you was like nah not really not not like <laughs> first when i first started dancing i was nervous but when i started going to it, like this one club cons consistently like yeah like new clubs like, and shit though yeah but like this is a bitch i'm in a new club new city like it's different yeah so i'm trying to figure out new state i should say it's i think it should be cool though yeah it seems like it's laid back i'm gonna go here and they gonna accept you like and you gonna make us some change you know what i'm saying because she wouldn't have told me to come back you know yeah she would have told you off rip like yeah, nah. no i ain't accepting if i was ugly yeah. nah, I was <laughs> Do they be doing that shit? Yeah, yeah, they be nah. Big girls in Des Moines, Iowa. Coming to get these farmers money. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, I'm weak as fuck. Just, that's all I think about when I think of Iowa, like cornfields. And like farmers and all that extra shit. Yeah. Yeah, we do got some farmers on here, but bitch, just some niggas out here too. Mm -hmm. But I'm telling you, like this parking lot on a fucking like Friday, Saturday, maybe a Thursday too. Mm -hmm. Thursday definitely probably. But this bitch be dick. Like I don't even know how the fuck everybody be fitting up in here. I don't know where them cars came from. Yeah. So me and my friend were thinking about driving to St. Louis, and I yeah. work out there. Which I think that'd be lit. I think that should be definitely be lit. They probably yeah. probably only lit on the weekend too. Hell yeah. Do y'all should be lit during the weekday? Like a Wednesday. Wednesdays be lit because it's Do late. Do ever look like this? Uh, only like when we first open up. Oh, uh, for real? Yeah. What time is it? Still early? Yeah, it's only eleven. Yeah, so I'm gonna go in here and try out. Wish me luck. I feel confident though. Once I get dressed and get the moving around, get a shot, I'll be good. Good. It's shedding? Yeah. It looks good though. Let me see. Hey. Make sure you wear your face mask or you get no ass. <laughs> 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 it got to. I didn't dance tonight. She told me that the club was fully new. I only danced at Topless, so I was kind of like, uh, let me go back, let me sleep on it, and we think about it. I'm gonna go work. I came out here to work. You know, like that's what I came out here to do. So I'm gonna go try again tomorrow. Work. And then, yeah. I'm going to Minx tomorrow at three. She told me to come try out at three and then I'm gonna go to Big Earl's later tonight, later that night. So I'm gonna do a day shift and a night shift at two different clubs. 
yeah so i can make up for today because i came out here to make some fucking money and that's what i'm gonna do so yeah guys we gonna try again tomorrow i went in there you know she was like oh you're pretty or whatever and she was like turn around that's why i wore a fitted dress like when you go try out somewhere wear a fitted dress so like it showed on like your shape you know because most of the time they don't even make you try out you don't have to audition you know you just get hired based off you know how your body look or whatever so she told me you know like you're you're so pretty like i wouldn't even have you try out you know or audition you know i'll just hire you but when i first got there you know she asked me have i danced before where we're at and i had to do an application and then they took my id or whatever no but she was like, come back Friday, Saturday. No, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. She said, come back and work those days for sure. But I'm gonna go back tomorrow too, just just to get a you know a feel of what the club is, what the club is like. So I'm gonna go Thursday, Friday, Saturday for sure, and tomorrow for sure. Like I extended my vacation. I won't even say vacation because I'm working. But I extended it until Sunday. Uh, but anyways, before I was rudely interrupted, yeah, oh, he's trying to call me. Bitch, I want to talk. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. I got a good feeling about this trip. I, I feel like I'm gonna make a lot of money on this trip. Hell yeah, I'm manifesting that shit. I'm gonna make a lot of money. I'm going to make a lot of money on this trip. Oh y'all, look at my fucking nails. I am so. I am so disgusted with these shits. Only way I get new is if, you know, I see money, money. I'm not just gonna be up there ass ball naked and there's no money. She told me like majority of all the clothes out here is nude. There's only one that's topless. And she said, don't nothing be going on there. Yeah, I'm gonna end this video. I'm sorry you guys, I didn't go to work today. I will go to work tomorrow for sure. I'm gonna vlog all day tomorrow. Start my day, I'm gonna even record y'all like how I'm getting ready to go to the club. Cause I feel like I'm always just getting ready. Like I get ready off camera and then I be recording when I get in the car. Like y'all be wanting to see that shit and I know y'all do. Like how I get ready, how I prepare myself. Like I'm gonna, I'm gonna start recording that shit because I know some girls wanna know because bitch i was wanting to know before i started dancing like how you prepare yourself you know do you wear makeup do you not wear makeup like what all do you do to get yourself ready for the work for work i don't do i don't wear makeup to the club i only wear it like if i feel like it's gonna be a big night most of the time it's just eyelashes and lip gloss for me that's it or maybe i ever feel my eyebrows but miss nikki baby Miss Nikki baby on the eyebrows. So if you need some eye if you need your eyebrows threaded and you live in Arizona, see these baby? I'm telling y'all, hold on, let me get a little closer. Y'all see them? She does her shit every time. Go to Miss Nikki baby. I'm put her Instagram right now. Right about the fucking hurt. I'm about to close this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please make sure to like comment and please y'all hit that subscribe button for me hit that subscribe button for a bitch i got the 300 subscribers so we moving somewhere period but y'all help me get to 500 help me get to 500 and i keep these videos coming period and that's all motherfucking period all right see you guys manana